Hey, hey, Chuck here again, and uh, today I'll be doing a test of the one mile FPV challenge. And so, got my quad set up here, um, 1500 milliamp battery, FR Sky R9 um, receiver, T motor F80 at 1900 kV and Lumineer Gatebreaker props um, 6050s. So, so this will be my first attempt and I've actually never flown um, one mile before. Um, I've flown close to a mile um, out but um, at this spot I have not. So um, let me um, give a rundown on, on what's going on at this flying spot right here. So let me Right. So basically we're on top of a hill and out there there's a building on the top of the other hill and that is an elementary school. So what I'm talking about is at the top of the hill out there there's a let's see if I can get my finger in here. There's a school right up there. It's about a mile away. So I'll be attempting to fly out there. The wind is actually crossing the path right now, so it's not uh, a tailwind or a headwind. But, um, so I'll be heading up to the top of that hill. It's about a mile away. If I fail safe anywhere in between, it's gonna be kinda sketchy getting to it, but at least there's access. So anyway, um, let me uh, just get it going. Hey, so let's talk about some of the pre-flight stuff that you have to do. Um, one of the things you want to do definitely is make sure your batteries are charged, that's obvious. But um, make sure that um, you're using your directional antenna. Make sure your antenna is pointed where you want to go. And basically you want to make sure that you have a line of sight. You want to make sure you have a line of sight to where you're, you're going to go flying. And you do not want to cross behind any objects and you don't want to go into any um, places where there's a lot of uh, things that are going to block. Um, your line of sight. So try to stay either high or in a complete uh, clear line of sight. So in this case I'll be flying across a little um, what looks like a little valley and I'm going to try to maintain my altitude so that once I get to the other side I'm about as high as I need to be but um, I want to like make sure I scope out where I'm flying and make sure that it's free of obstructions and when I start off flying I'm going to make sure that my um, directional antenna is pointed where I'm going to go and uh, yeah that's it oh, oh one other thing is like if you're gonna be flying for distance make sure you understand um, either how long your flight time is or how many milliamp hours you're drawing from your battery and and go about half of that and make sure you can uh, get back safely so so here we go um, got GPS on this thing and we're gonna make sure we have a GPS lock before we go and we do not have do not have, um, what do they call it, rescue mode turned on. So I should have done that before I left, it left, but I have not tested it, so I don't know how that's gonna work. Okay, so let's get going. All right, I'll be trying for the one mile challenge. Kind of scary, but um, I guess I gotta try it. So let's see, we are on. Um, we've got about 16.7 volts on the, battery Let's see make sure my antenna is pointed where I'm gonna go so I'm gonna go on right there all right so wish me luck gonna fire up now all right heading straight out about 50% uh, throttle, doing about 70 kilometers per hour. Flying over the construction site. Got quite a bit of um, vibration on the quad. Looking at uh, 99 RSSI, 
you know, kind of shaky. Video's still looking strong. Used about 300 milliamps so far. And that um, thousand meters. 93 RSSI. Pretty nervous, my fingers are shaking. Uh, 1400 meters. 1500, 1600 meters. Oh, I forgot to do it. Split S, that was a shitty split S. Okay. Head back. That's 67 percent throttle. Uh, a little scary. 1300 meters left. Battery voltage is dropping 14.3 uh, volts. I'm across the road. I'm doing about 100 kilometers per hour. Let's see if we can hold 100. 96. At 14.2 volts. Yeah, gained a little bit too much altitude, I think. Coming in at 14.2 volts. 14 volts. Here we go. And that time is 224. I'm gonna call it, I'm gonna call it two minutes 30 seconds. Oh wow. Okay. Wow. That was a little nerve-wracking. I was pretty nervous on that one. Pretty nervous. Alright, let me run this battery down a little bit. That was pretty nerve-wracking. 2.30 for the one-mile challenge. Alright. That's gonna about do it. Alright, so VCR or DVR is recorded. That was about a 2 minute 30 second uh, out and back mile. I did a pretty shitty split S on the end, forgot. But next time I'll pay more attention. Probably could shave some time for sure. So, um, came back with enough voltage. Alright, success. One mile out. Okay, well, that was my first one mile, one mile I don't know what you would call it, mid-range FPV flight, and it was pretty nerve-wracking, but got through it, and that'll also be my, sort of my first example, or first uh, entry into the one mile FPV challenge. So I'll be back on another day when it's not so hot. I'm just kinda sweating my ass off right now. So in any case, um, we'll head back and uh, get this video edited and uh, upload it onto the channel. Alright, thanks for watching and uh, catch you next time.